Hey, it's Michelle, and I'm back with Tiffany Southern Grails Designs for another Yumi Seam 3. This month, our three items came from Tiffany's friend Kim Cataldo, and I'm not listing any of her information. She has a private account on Instagram, but she sent us four items, actually. Um, a picture of distant relatives in her family, and that neat piece of paper with circles, and then the marbled paper, the wrapping paper kind of paper, and I think that was it. <laughs> so anyhow, um, I just wanted to show you what I did. I found a page and then I had glued pieces of copies of the wrapping paper type item. And um, I'm going to tell you why I made copies <laughs> because I forgot to hit record and that's why that happened. And sometimes I do that. So I tend to make copies just in case I do something like that now. Um, anyhow, I am just putting a base down anything down to break the page a little bit and I'm not sure what I'm gonna do but um yeah it will come to me in a sporadic crazy kind of mess that you know it just wouldn't be me without it but anyhow I'm trying to make some an orangish color that matches the marbling on the paper because I thought those colors were pretty and I was trying to bring those into just kind of like a diluted background diluted muted muted background in the for the page. So that's what I'm doing. I'm kind of trying to replicate that color, which I thought I had, but I didn't. So, hey, I have tons of paint. I can make that color. Um, and I'm just putting those down on that little piece of oven liner that I'm using as a palette. And I don't even know why I'm doing this because it ends up getting covered in the end, but I did it anyway, so I included it. Um, it is the day after Christmas. I hope everyone had a great holiday in whatever way you celebrate. I know that we did. Um, and I am actually <laughs> editing and doing this on the day after Christmas, right before it goes live, because I am the world's biggest procrastinator. And um, I'll get it done. Believe me, I'll get it done. But I might be sliding in at the very last minute. So that's what's happening. <laughs> so anyhow, we had a great Christmas yesterday. And I hope everyone else did too. I know the holidays can be hard for people um, for lots of reasons. I know it does get harder the older you get when you lose people. And so just know that um, I'm thinking of you and I hope y'all are able to do some art and get a little therapy in there um, before you start the next holiday season. So anyhow, I did want to let everyone know that the next packets for February's Yumi 3 will be available towards the end of the first week in January. I'll be going to Michigan and I'll be back the beginning of that first week and then I'll get them together and I'll list them. But I will let everyone know before I list them, kind of give a heads up. Um, I know last time Tiffany said they sold out fast, so... If you would like one, make sure you follow both of us on Instagram so that when it's our month to list them, we can give you guys a little bit of a heads up. Anyhow, I took this little piece of paper. It kind of reminded me with the little circles of a tapestry and you know how there's pictures woven into kind of fabric. So I took the picture and because I made copies, I'm able to get enough pictures to use a circle punch. That's a one inch circle punch and just cut out little pictures and then I also cut out pieces of the marbled paper and pieces of the wallpaper and kind of put them in the little circles and you'll see how that all comes about um, but I'm going to put some music on so I don't talk and bore y'all throughout this whole thing and I will pop back in like I usually do I will have all my supplies that I can remember listed through my Amazon affiliate link. Remember, if you use that, I will get a small compensation. But again, like always, use what you have. Um, anyhow, I'm going to go ahead and put some music on.
flag Fire of fire Send out a flare To find Give me a reason I'm gonna send a sign Calling you over Calling you to my life We're off and away We're around the world together So off and away Come again It's now or never We're going away You never know what we will find Behind the line Find behind the line
make love better if we both know we'll be together forever we can be like the trees in the wind same old roots but we can bend learning to understand and sway together we can be like the trees in the Okay, so I have my tapestry done and I used some pieces of canvas that and just frayed the edges to kind of make it look more like, I don't know, I guess it kind of looks like a rug now, but um, it's a tapestry, right? <laughs> That's what I'm saying it is. Anyhow, I covered up all the paint that I put on because I put kind of like the white back around the edging so I had to bring some more color back into it just because I felt the background needed something and then I wanted to um, I don't know I guess kind of distress it up a little bit it was looking too pristine so I kind of tore some edges away and then I wanted to just kind of make the tapestry stand out a little bit so I just edged along the top and bottom and and then I typed out a little saying as soon as I figured out that that was going to be a tapestry. And so I just typed that on my typewriter. And um, there it is right there. It says, in the tapestry of life, we're all connected. And um, there was more to it. So I just kind of put the dot. I forget what that's called. Is that ellipses? What's that called? The dot, dot, dot. I don't know. Anyhow, I put that there just to let you know that there is more to the quote if you're interested at all. And I'm just going to take that little piece of canvas and I think that's canvas. I'm not sure what it is. I got it from the thrift store and there was like a bunch of remnants of it. Um, I just used the walnut ink crystals to kind of dye it to look like the rug <laughs> up above. And then I sewed through it just to give some strings some black thread just a little bit of contrast and then I'm just using a new pastel to kind of bring that it left kind of like a mustardy color on that um, the paper with circles from old tape I think and I wanted to kind of bring that in so I put a little bit of that on my quote and that's pretty much my page thank you all so much for watching and remember to subscribe and leave us a comment and if you have any questions do that too. Make sure you go check out what Tiff made. I'm looking forward to seeing what she creates. Um, yeah, these, these items were a little bit of a challenge, I'll be honest. So I really am looking forward to seeing what she came up with. Anyhow, stay tuned at the end for some stills and uh, make sure you let us know what you think. Thanks so much. Bye. Oh, and happy new year too. Let's hope 2021 is an amazing year for all of us. Thanks again. Bye.